Howdy y'all, it's your host Road. Welcome back to Love It Games. We're continuing our journey today on Tales of Siphonia, so I hope you enjoy. Please like, comment, subscribe, share the video, and tell me what you think in the comment section down below. We're gonna come over here and talk to Prisea, help her with her sacred wood, and see if we can go visit the king. So let's get right back to it. Sorry to keep you waiting. Wait, is it not just Persea today? Who are you people? We're helping her deliver the sacred wood to use in the prayer ceremony. Today is special. Alright, you may pass. Excuse us, coming through. Are lumberjacks all women and children these days? Huh. That Persea who hardly ever talks said so, it must be fine. Well, we managed to make it inside. What will we do with the sacred wood? Leave it here. Okay, now let's go look for the royal chambers. What will you do, Persea? Yes, sitting in our back lawn would be suspicious. Let's have her come with us. Would you do that for us? You join the party. Um... Actually, let's swap you and you. What text does Persea know? Strong, eternal, heavy hit, find food items. We need to change this to uh, S type. Increase the stats when alone in battle. Occasionally avoid receiving status effects. Increase amount of damage take. So you switch her to all S. Cooking, I still want rain. Equipment. Let's keep it as default for now. We are the proud Imperial Guard, trusting with guarding the king himself. This is the audience chamber. Only ones who may enter here are those who have permission for an audience. You may not approach the throne. That leaves... First we need to see the king. Here's a soldier's quarters. Are you sure you're in the right place? Better get to sleep for work tomorrow. Take good care of your weapons and armor for unexpected situations. It's our duty to protect the castle. Don't cause any trouble in here. If you do, we will show no mercy. The dungeon lies beyond here. If you do not have business here, we need you to refrain from entering. You cannot allow anyone to enter here without the Pope's permission. I can go into the dungeon, can't do anything in the dungeon. Can I talk to you? Yeah, protect the castle. I'm surprised that people like you are able to enter the castle. What do you mean, like me? 
All right, those probably go into something else. What do we got here? Crimson Chamber. It is a guest room for noble visitors. I want guard duty, so don't talk to me. My humblest apologies, but I must request that you not enter with dirty shoes. It will soil the floor that I just cleaned. Not a single wrinkle of stains from right on the bed sheets. These are the royal chambers. Don't want to go to the royal chambers just yet. I want to explore the rest of the castle before I go and piss off a king. I've never seen you before. I haven't seen you either. I'm patrolling the inside of the castle. Diligent security will starve off those who seek to infiltrate the castle. This is the castle archive. There are many valuable items, so without permission you may not enter. Save spot. Ordinary seditions, not one of the halls of the castle. Kitchen prepares meals for the entire castle. I hope dinner is ready soon. Cleaning, laundry, cooking, and even serving. Working at the castle is tiring. I'm an apprentice cook. Yeah, it's a big job preparing meals for everyone that works in the castle. Mind you, I love cooking, so it's alright. The secret to flip your frying pan is with your wrist. Alright! Hey you, who gave you permission to come here? We brought sacred wood, but we're asked to aid with our preparations for the prayers. There's an order from the Pope. The Pope? I... Just a moment, I'll ask. Sorry about this. What's going on? Oh, it's you people. Oh, you're the one we met in... Chosen, do you know them? Chosen? Well, I don't know if I'd say I know them. Just what are you people doing here? So you're Kethiolo's Chosen of Mana. What? This guy is the Chosen? What do you mean Tethiolos? Are you from Silveront? Yes, we are. These are the people from the Declining World. Princess, have no fear. So what's your name? Lloyd. Lloyd, for what purpose have you come here? You come to deliver this letter. It's from Sheena of Mizho to the king. Sheena? What's your relationship with Sheena? Sheena? Your majesty, please forgive us for causing disturbance in your presence. Lloyd, give me the letter. Here it is. People of Silveront, wait in the other room for a while. Pastor, show them to the Crimson Chamber. Yes, your emirates. They're making us wait a long time. They may be preparing to kill us. To them, Klet is an obstacle. If things turn out like that, what will become of Perseo? We'll have to find some way to let her escape. I'm sorry for dragging you into this, Perseo. Sorry to keep you waiting, travelers from Silveron. So you read the letter. You want to use Tethiala's technology to save the Chosen from your side, right? But has lost her soul. She'll lose her life as a human if she stays this way. But as long as the Chosen lives, our world teeters on the brink of destruction. Just like Rain said, Wait, please listen to what we... I don't want to hear it. Get them. Damn it, they can't even scratch her. See, I told you, they have x spheres. Of course they're powerful. Oh, you're not as dumb as you look. Impudent little brat. What would you say to making a deal? A deal? Blood has lost her soul because she's being reborn as an angel in order to save Silverant. But as long as she does not become an angel, Silverant will not be saved. I see, so we save the Chosen, Tethiala will be saved as well. That means it'll be abandoned in Silveron. I don't care. Professor, what are you saying? Our priority right now is to save Colette, is it not? But abandoning Silveron? Alright, that's fine. 
It's okay to decide something like that so easily? Right now, the most important thing is to save Colette. That's why we came all the way to Tetheala, right? Is this... is there eternal discord? No, we'll do as the professor suggested and make a deal. So please tell us how to save Colette. Hey Pope, if these guys don't want to go back to Silveron, then it doesn't matter if they're alive or dead. They cannot complete the regeneration cycle. So as long as I keep tabs on them, they should be fine. If you insist, Chosen One. Then you'll save Colette, right? Well, we'll do all we can anyways. I swear on my name is Zealous the Chosen. Alright, I'll give you permission to travel Tethiala, but under the Chosen's observation. I guess we don't have much of a choice. Okay, that's fine. Then it's settled. I'm going to get ready so we can meet up later. Where do you want to meet? How about the Martel Cathedral? Alright. Then Chosen One, please report this to His Majesty. We got it. See you later. My gorgeous lady, cute, chosen, and tiny rosebud. And you servant boys. Crimson Chamber. Oh, come on. There it is. Can I just go this way? Because it's literally where I'm trying to go. I have to walk outside to walk right back in. So annoying. Yo, Lloyd! You're finally here! Uh, Zelos, right? Yep, yep. I'm the great Zelos Wilder. But you can just call me Zelos. We're gonna be traveling together for a while, so uh, let's be friends, okay? He sounds like he doesn't take anything seriously. Let's see, putting aside the two guys, this gorgeous beauty is Rain, right? And then this cool cutie here would be Colette. And then who's this little one? Prisea, she helped us sneak into the castle. The little one isn't from Silverant? Ozette. Ozette? That village out in the boonda? I mean, out in the forest? Ah, oh, that's so sad. You're being used by these uncivilized barbarians. Who are you calling uncivilized barbarians? Hey, 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 don't get mad. Especially after all the trouble I went through to contact the Imperial Research Academy for you. Not bad, Zelos. I know. Using the Research Academy requires permission from the king. But when the great Zello speaks, his majesty listens. Since you're going to be keeping tabs on us, I'd certainly expect that much. You're an obnoxious brat, you know that? Going to the Imperial Research Academy is fine. But can we have you free Prisea? Surely you don't need to keep tabs on her as well. No. The Imperial Research Academy and Ozette are both on the continent across the sea. So we can just drop her off when we go. I, I agree! That's a great idea! Is that okay with you, Prisea? Yes. Okay, then. Where should we go? To Cybac. It's on the other side of the Grand Tetheala Bridge. It's northeast of here. The Imperial Research Academy. I'm getting excited just thinking about it. Let's go, everybody. And now we got Zelos. Uh, we are going... To swap. Wait, I honestly should keep Lloyd in the party. First dagger. Yeah, we'll use that. Let's see, what are you? You are T T T S type. Hmm. 
I may change you to S-type. You're still set up there. You're gonna be T-type. Alright! Unauthorized personnel, can't go that way. Don't know if there's anything over here, we're gonna run into this building. Not dinner time yet. I know Zealous lives up here somewhere, but I want to see if the Coliseum is open now. Oh, I forgot. We need to talk to every female in the game as Zealous. Honey, how are you? Chaz one of these, same as always. Are you my beloved? Hey, you're an interesting man. Oh, hi, Charmin. Oh, now, now, Zillows. Yeah, that's a thing. I missed you, honey. Oh, unless I'm wrong, I'm a servant of the goddess. I can't. We must talk to everyone. Honey, how are you? Hello, Chazelle. Let's pray together. I forgot about this. In both Tethiala and in Silveron. So. I think there's a list of lines. I missed you, honey. Oh, chosen one, my job really please come for me. Oh, you're a good girl. Hee hee hee. Jill. My beautiful rosebud. Oh, chosen, hi. Can't carry any more melon. Oh, hi, Charming. Oh, Zillas. Money. He literally flirts with every woman in the game. It's you, honey. Oh, Chosen One blush. Can't carry any more strawberries. Hello, madam. Hi, my name is Ellis. She gave you just a tuna. Crimson Chamber. One guard duty, so don't talk to me. Missed you, honey. Hi, right, chosen one. Hello. Give orange gel. We got a lot of crap to sell, probably. On duty, protect the castle. Double check. There's no one down here. Doesn't look like it. I think guards are unisex. If you miss one female NPC, you got to start completely over. Ah, oh, greeting chosen. Are these your friends? Hello, my beloved. Hello, shrimp. Beer. All right, you're a dude. Little beauty. I oh, chose one. Some wrong. Orange gel. Yes, and you're a man. Man, yeah. Still constantly scolded by a teacher. I won't give up. You don't count as a female. Interesting. Uh, 
Oh, madam, I chose one. I always think of Enter the Fist. Chosen one! I think this is the Chosen One's house. May I help you? No, I guess not. Alright, so we clear all the female NPCs up there for now. How are you doing? Please stop teasing. My cute little princess shows will you play with me? Hi, beautiful chosen one. How are you? Think you're all men? Yeah. He called you charming. Sorry, entrance is already over. Are you a dude or a woman? Hi, charming. Oh, you look well. She gave you a life bottle. Man. Gonna be a little bit of a pain to try to remember to visit every single woman of the game as Zillow's. You're all dudes. Oh, I forgot. Do you have... Oh, there you go. Looks like a mercenary. Honey, how are you? Chose one, are you out for a walk? Orange gel. Success, you've already got all the monsters. Well, that's good. Sell one, sell one, sell three, sell one, sell five, sell six, sell four. Since we're going to be getting items from everyone, it's best to uh, have some open inventory. Hello, beauty. Oh, Chosen, I'm glad to see you're well. Beautiful rosebud. Orange gel. There's something. No, there's not. Running around. Let's see. Hi, beautiful. Oh, Chosen, greetings. Honey, are you zealous? Welcome. Hello, madam. Hi, chosen one. Honey, how are you? Ah, chosen one. Actually, let us stay for the night. Sidebeck, where we're headed next, is a wonderful city. Really, what kind of place is it? Perhaps the Imperial Research Academy is there. It's always been a city with a great passion for education and research. That doesn't sound wonderful at all. Really, I think it sounds like a marvelous city. Doesn't it, though? It's just packed with intellectual girls. 
The faint central charm of intelligent women. Mm. I should have known. Yep, intellectual honeys. Please take care. And always wear fresh underwear. Hello, beauty. Oh, my chosen one. Alright. You're a dude. I'm guessing you're a dude. You're a female. Hi, you're charming. You know I'm a half elf, right? Because you're a half elf doesn't mean anything. You can make quarter elf babies. If you want to. Chosen one, do you have business in a place like this? Hello, beauty. Ah, oh, thank you. Can't go in. You're a dude, right? Yeah, you're a dude. Hello, madam. Ah, oh, what the? You're a boy? Yeah, you are. Eh, sometimes you don't know unless you ask. Alright, so... Zealous Wilder at the All of Chosen. They want us to go straight to the bridge. I want to go right back to little Hamlet over here because I don't see another reason to come back to it. We don't. Chosen, you man. You're just a sailor. The amount of those grab bags I have bought now is ridiculous. Man or woman? Hello, my beloved. Oh, my tea. Expensive night sleep again. But, this area, what is open to us currently, we have now visited everywhere to talk to every female NPC we currently can talk to. Whoa! This is gonna be a piece of- Honestly, Hurricane Thrush should be there. Left is Janus, right, Prisea. The cake! Demon Fennis! <laughs> Demon Fang! Demon Fang! Hellfire! Ground Dasher! Affirmative! Hellfire! Hellfire! Fire! Hellfire! Engulf these pathetic Demon Fang! Hellfire! Ground Dasher! Hurricane Thrust! 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 Not even a contest. Zealous discovered compound skill. Per se, discover compound skill. We failed to make spaghetti. 
So we learn prevents physical elements, overtime limit is increased, critical hit is increased, overtime limit increased, unison attack power, chances to get critical hit. Rhythm and speed cast. Is there any other T type? They all a bridge. Whoa, that's a huge bridge. Listen, be amazed, bumpkins. This is the greatest straw bridge in the world. It connects the continents of Altamira and Fuji. The control system incorporates 3,000 exospheres, 3,000 human lives. Oh, what? What's wrong? What's with those faces? I suppose I better tell you. That's a pretty sobering story if it's really true. You think we'd make something like that up? Well, even so, it's not like the dead are going to come back to life at this point. It's always best to look the bright side of things. I can tell he's a positive thinker or just doesn't care about anything. Since we're on the subject of you and Priscilla, I both have exospheres too. Does everyone have exospheres in this world? It doesn't sound like it from the way Sheena talked about them. Uh, nope, I got these from the guys who call themselves the Renegades. They distributed quite a few to Sheena and the Palpal Knights and such. And Persea? Beats me. Well, little one? She's so talkative. Welcome, Chosen One and Travelers from Silveron. Here it comes. The mana is growing thin. Please be careful. You call this thin? Then Silveron must be dried up husk. Everything over here is closed off. I love the ocean, it's so grand. Messy Faye, it's so great that we meet on this date. Let's play, let's play. Show me my record. Highest level cleared, zero. What is this game? A red light, green light? I do want to do this, but I don't want to do this right now. Maybe later, huh? I've been looking for where to do red light, green light because I couldn't remember. Nicknames. Well then, I'd like to take this opportunity to cite everyone's nicknames. What are you talking about all of a sudden? Well, you can call me Mr. Zellos. Perseo will be little one. Paulette is Miss Angel. Lloyd is Hey You, and Genus is Brad. Jeez, he's gonna spend a long time thinking about Lloyd. Ah, oh, don't mention Anne. Then Rain will be the gorgeous, ultra cool beauty. I don't want to be called that, huh? Then Her Highness? Bellows, can you come up with something a little bit more normal? 
professor is a professor. What else would you like? Huh, professor. That does have a ring to it. Bewitching female teacher. Hehehe. <laughs> hey, okay, fine. I don't care anymore. And then Professor Rain it is. Whatever. Oh, big bridge. Again, it's a big bridge. Ozette and Quillette. Ozette. What about it? I have a feeling I've heard that name before. Are you sure you ain't thinking of Colette? Hmm? Ozette and Colette sound kind of the same, you know? Ow, you don't have to hit me. Dude, this bridge is huge. Hey, we found the other end. There's no one over here. Similar. Looking at those two like this, don't they look kind of similar? You think so? They hardly ever smile, you know. A girl's not the same without a pretty smile. But can't smile even if she wanted to. So don't say things like that. I'm sorry, she's touchy touchy. See what do we got going on over here? Is it dock? Some sort of village over here. That's Cybeck. I don't want to go straight to Cybeck. Not yet. We will, but just not yet. I want to explore. At the Allah's Architectural technology. That was a huge bridge. Yes, the engineering is impressive. Something like that couldn't be built in Silveron. Isn't it, though? There's a baby. That baby was built by a company owned by Duke Bryan, one of the Tethel's famous three Dukes. I love to see the blueprints. The main office building of Luzerel Company is the one who took the design contract is located in the city of Almertha. If we go there, you could possibly see them. Altamira. No, no side tracking allowed. It's the opposite of how it usually goes. Okay, there's a spot over there. Am I able to go through over here? Not look like it. Everyone wants to kill me. Anything? Oh, Perseo, what kind of work do you do? I'm a lumberjack. Lumberjack? What a cute job. Um, that's very ladylike. Ladylike? Oh my goodness, there's people everywhere. There's a forest. I'll go to it for a second. Hey, this is a forest of no return. As long as I'm here, I'm not letting you go into any dangerous places like this. Are you scared? No, no, no. I just want to protect my cute honeys. Hey, I said you can't go in there. Fine. Wait. That looks like a human ranch. 
Or no, there's just a city or something back there. Alright, I think that's as far as we can go unless we want to go into side back. The side back, here we come. The university town, side back. I hate this city. Hurry to us up. I'm sorry, Prisea. Be just a minute, little one. We'll be done in a jiffy, right, Lloyd? Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm engaging the research to increase the potency of exospheres. Now, with the advancement of exosphere research on non-human subject, I don't think it's necessary to spend so much time researching key crafts. Hello, my beloved. You know what to say to a lady. Lemon gel. Honey, how are you? Hello, handsome. I developed an item that uses the power of Summon Spirit of Wind to increase the potency of fire magic. I think I'll call it Bellows. Tiny exospheres and poorly constructed key crests can be tamed in the bazaar. Those aren't anything we can use. Meow. Welcome to Cat's Exploration Team. Do you need something? Quest. Monsters. We'll do our best. Meow. Look around. There's a lot of good stuff. Welcome. Friday shop. Yeah, let's see your Friday shop. Buying all your weapons so you don't have crap to sell. Spending all the monies. I said you had a customization. Ah, uh, staff. Welcome. Now yeah, we're good for now. Academic resource building. Happiness charms. These happiness charms that Prisea makes are incredibly popular in Melateco now. Oh, wow, that's great. That's our Prisea. Oh, really? What kind of charm? A bear. What? The card wooden bear it has a salmon in its mouth. A bear? A salmon? If you place it at the entrance of your house, it'll make you rich. Yes. Welcome to the campus cottage. Yeah, we'll stay. $300 a night. I'm here to research or present the reason results of my research, but everyone seems to be busy and won't accept my thesis. Honey, how are you? I've oh, chosen. This is quite a coincidence meeting you here. Hey, you gave us fine pellets. Now, there's a lot of pellets out there, but how many of them are fine pellets? Imperial Research Academy lies ahead. It's the ultimate think tank where intelligent people from around the world gather. So we'll go in here first. Sharp nose spotted Jabora. Jabora. Hey Perse, do you make anything besides wooden bears with salmon in their mouths? Brooches. Oh hey, I can make those too. We're two of a kind. I can make them too. Sharp nose spotted Jabora. What? Sharp nose spotted Jabroa brooches. It's a type of mouse that lives only in the area around Ozette. The sharp nose spotted Jabroa mouse brooches that Prisea makes are super popular among noble women. Maybe you two are, you are not two of a kind after all. Looking for a book titled The Effects of Strange Chemicals. Honey, how are you? Chosen, please be quiet. Huh, no fun. Can't care anymore. There are no reference materials that are not in this library. It's a bit of an odd expression. According to the re reference, the body is a vessel of the consciousness. Aye, you're charming. Aw, oh, you hit on me? Someone hit on me. The elven race is skilled in magic, but they do not view 
It has a special ability. Honey, how are you? Hee <laughs> hee, here you go. Hi, you're charming blush. Can't get any more black. Whatever. I'm looking for the material regarding prehistoric civilizations. Alright. Enough in here. Even with a the perfect theory, when you actually test it, things don't always go the way as you expected it. Nope. Hello, my beloved. Well, I never. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm not used to being hit on. Being a member of the Imperial Research Academy is being the ultimate honor of a researcher. What? Missed you, honey. Oh, can I help you? The Academy has turned into into a royal facility two kings ago. Since then, it's progressed with incredible speed to become the greatest learning institution. This is Imperial Research Academy. Yeah, there. We're from Melateco. Oh, Chazelon, we've been waiting for you. Please come this way. Upon receiving the report of Colette's symptoms, we focus our attention to research regarding the Chosen's Crucius Crystal. Ah, so my crystal was useful. When Colette returns to normal, I'll need to make sure she thanks me generously. Crucius Crystal are thought to be evolved forms of exospheres. Both exospheres and Crucius Crystals are lifeless beings. What did you say? Lifeless, what? Lifeless beings, how should I put it? Basically, exospheres are alive. They're not in the same way we are. Yes, both these crystals are parasites fusing with other life forms. Parasites, huh? Not a very pleasant thought. That happening, the mana within the body loses balance and goes out of control without a key crest. So why exospheres without key crest turn people into monsters? Exactly, in other words, since the Crucius crystals possess the same quantity qualities as exospheres, we surmise that Colette is suffering from a parasitical infection by the Crucius crystal. I see, in which case the ritual of releasing the seals may be Promoting the fusion of the Crucius Crystal. Fascinating. Professor, don't talk like that after all the bad things that keep happening to Cleb. But obtain the title Ill-Fated Girl. Then if she had a key crest, she'd return to normal, right? Yeah, she should be able to freely control the Crucius Crystal if she had a key crest. Key crest, huh? I wonder if someone could get one somewhere. Zip. Ah, you're charming. Yes, you are here visiting. I came here to get materials to use in my experiments, but apparently this room is now being used for food storage. Out the door. Alright. Hi, you're charming what? Can't carry more bread. Here, we're going through all this. Is she serious? Hey, little reading never hurt anyone. Honey, how are you? Me... My, you're certainly out of place here. Are you escorting someone today? Yeah, it's a snapper. Have you seen the summoned spirit of Earth? Yes, I actually have. Can't believe this, so maybe I'll have to assign me a different professor. Oh, are you a new student? What's your major? Study hard now. Hmm. Hello, my beloved. Oh my, you're making me blush. Orange gel. I'm hungry. You know what, dude? Honestly, I am too. I made some gumbo, and I may end up eating it here in a bit. Magic is the process of slightly accelerating the action of summon spirits. We're researching the possibility of artificially storing magic spells. That would be cool. I missed you, honey. Oh no, students must focus on their studies, and here you are tempted me. We're studying the food chain of fish. Fish eat other fish, and poop. We're researching the possibility. yeah, I already know you. Hello, my beloved. Hee <laughs> hee, you're fun. I said that the LG and other forms of aquatic life here are origins of all life.
Please don't go into the basement. There are no hidden laboratories. Don't be telling me don't go into the basement. Locked. Tell me not to go in the basement makes me want to go in all the more. Heyo! These creatures that flourished long ago, they were surmised to have perished. But when they are unable to cope with rapid changes in the environment, in order to survive the living, they must be able to adapt. Whenever I'm stuck in my research, I try to be alone. Hi, you're charming and shy. I envy your carefree attitude. Honey, how are you? Would you like to eat some cake with me? They say that if you're a consumer of DHA, you get smarter. Can I talk to you? There. Welcome to the cafeteria. Because we need to buy a bunch of ingredients we've been using. Making our way through all of our ingredients. Thank you. Welcome to the cafeteria. Oh, I didn't realize we had ran out of cucumber. Hi, you're charming. Hee hee hee, thank you. I don't want to go out yet. Honey, how are you? I'm sorry I'm not interested. Are you familiar with game theory? Actually, yes, because I did a bunch of history of video game design and design of building games. Do you think melons are fruits or vegetables? Hi, you're charming. Pretty flowers have thorns. Hi, you're charming. Hello. Science is formulating theories based on data, then verifying them. See if these plants are prey on small animals. I'm doing research to achieve the greatest possible yield from crops. Observations that ignore the existence theory lack persuasion. Hello, my beloved. Love is actually the animal instinct to pass on one's genes to... Ah, okay. I'm sorry I got in your way. I guess you've learned your lesson. Turn on there. Alright, so we've made it through two floors of this academy. I think we've talked to all the women so far. Alright. Were you here before? Yes, so. What's this place? All of your son is junk. It's marvelous. This is just marvelous. Oh, this ancient magi technology carbon. There she goes again. Oh come on, please look for something that looks like a key crest. There's a key crest. What, you want this piece of junk? Yeah, how much? See, ten thousand gold. Taking advantage of people in need. It's a business after all. Okay, you can call the one responsible for this bazaar right now. I'll make sure you can't do business anymore. What who are you? You have some guts to be ignorant of the great zealous the chosen. Chosen? Please take this junk, I mean, humbly offer this up to you. Please forgive me. Good, good. I like your attitude. I'll remember you. Ha 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 ha. Thanks, Zealous. Nothing. It's for my cute clip. 
Alright, I'll borrow a lab in the academy and fix it. Success, you've already got all the monsters in this area. What about items? I bet we have all the items. Why is there somebody in front of the door? Sorry to bother you, but can I borrow a lab? He wants to make a key crest. Oh, Cheswan, please make use of the room you were in earlier. I don't remember which room I was in earlier. Was it this one? I'll repair the key, Chris, so just wait at the entrance. Sure, sure. Okay, I think this will do. I didn't think I'd be giving you your birthday present like this. I've attached a key crest to your necklace. It's late, but it's my present for you. What? Can you hear me? How is it? it doesn't seem to work. How about asking Dirk for help? But Dirk's in Silverrock. The reds are out of fuel. Maybe the people here at the academy might know of a way. Hey, hey. Wait a moment. Aren't you forgetting something? I'm here to keep tabs on you. I can't let you go back to Silveron. Well then, just come along with us, oh compassionate chosen one. What, are you serious? You, you're kind of girls, right? Yeah, if you're here to save Colette, you gotta keep quiet about it for us, right? Great, how am I supposed to snitch after hearing that? Okay, all we need is fuel. Chosen, we heard what you said just now. We hereby declare you and your companions to be traitors attempting to destroy Tetheolo. Huh. Well, that was perfect timing, Mr. Papal Knight. It's by the Pope's orders that I'm to watch you for suspicions of plotting against the throne. Yeah, now it's amusing I'm the one who's plotting against the throne. Restrain them and don't take a, a sample. Don't touch that angel. If you approach her carelessly, she will kill you. Ow, what are you doing? Criminals undergo biological tests before they are arrested. It's because of the caste system here. Some half-elves don't look any different than humans. It's necessary to detect them. Sure, we found a match. Genus and Professor. So you're half-elves. Half-elves, is that true? That's right. Rain? No point in trying to hide it now. These pathetic half-elves have engaged in shameless caste deception. What did you say? The professor and genius are much better than you people. Who cares if they're half-elves? I don't know what it's like in your world, but over here, half-elves are at the bottom of the caste system. Half-elves, guilty of crimes, are all to be executed without exception. That's insane. Take them away. Genius, professor. Change in play and half elves can use magic, so we must keep them under heavy guard. We don't have any spare forces. We'll return to the bridge and call for reinforcements. As for the chosen and the others, just lock them in the basement or something. Who's there? Don't speak to us, half elf. Be quiet and continue your work. They're criminals. Hold them here until we return for them. Criminals, if you had a good fortune of being born human, don't throw that away. We haven't done anything. Well, you did try to go back to Silverout. Shut up. Ah, get away. Persea, you're Persea. Why are you here? You know Persea? Ah, I, she's a half-elf in the Imperial Research Academy is acquainted with a human child. That's strange. Why? I told you half-elves are treated like garbage in this world. The half elves that work for the Imperial Research Academy never leave their labs, ever. That's insane. Put that aside now, how does a half elf that can never leave here know Persea? This child is my team's research sample. Research? What kind of research? 
Research to manufacture Crucis crystals inside the human body. You mean make Crucis crystals? Yes, theoretically they are no different than exospheres. By allowing them to slowly feed on the human body... What, what? That's the same way the designs made exospheres. What are you talking about? I'm saying, how can you treat people that way? I can ask you the same thing. How can humans treat half-elves like the way they do? I treat them the same as everyone else. There's no difference between the lives of humans and half-elves. This isn't from... He isn't from Tetheala. Sheena. He's a strange one who is raised in Silveront with half-elves and a dwarf. Sheena, how did you know we... I'll explain later. Genus and Rain are being taken to Malatoko. If we go after them now, we should be able to save them. Are you planning on running away? Are you going to try to stop us? He's going to save his half-elf best friend. What are you going to do, Miss Half-Elf? I won't let you trick me. There's no way a human would save a half-elf. Okay, I did hear they arrested two half-elves up above. There's no time. If you're going to get in our way, we'll just have to fight you. Fine, I'll let you go if you promise that once you've saved your half-elf friends, you'll come back here. What you say is true. I'll release Prisea from her experiment. You promise? I swear upon the name of the goddess Martel. Okay. And come over here. There's a hidden passage. You can escape to the surface through the store. Thanks. Hurry, right, we need to head toward the bridge. By whose order was Perse's experiment carried out? I can't say. The Pope, then. Those, come on. I know, I know. Sheesh. It's all right for you to linger here. You have business with Kate, right? Can't go out that way. Curiosity towards the unknown. Colette! She really doesn't respond to anything. Hey, you aren't doing anything funny to her, are you? What? Of course not. Because it wouldn't surprise me at all if you did something like that. What do you mean by that? You tried peeking at me in the shower before. That's just natural curiosity towards the unknown. Oh, brother. The angel transformation definitely doesn't look like something I want to go through. Still not back. So what we are... Change you is Sheena. Honestly, I'd rather play as Sheena. And for a bit, I'll pop to an all girls party besides Zealous. And heck. What? Why did that get disabled? That's odd. the field. Hurry along Tethiala's bridge. Damn it. I hope they're all right. Part of the Grand Tethiala Bridge is the drawbridge. If they raise the bridge on us, there's nothing we can do. Movement speed reduction resulting from conversation is a result. Yeah, say is right. We've got to hurry. Oh, 
Why is there so many things in the way? Oh my goodness. You gotta dig the music. One bridge. Two bridge. Sheena spell. You will get better. You will get better. Sigh. What are you doing? Nothing. I just was wishing Clet to return to normal. I see. Hope she gets back to normal soon. Yeah, me too. I gotta dig the music on this. But at three, I think this is four. I may have lost count of one. Five. I still need to come back for red light, green light. Jump it! Whoa, whoa, wait! Time out! Are you nuts? We'll die if we fall from here. And if we abandon them, they'll die too! Let us continue our pursuit. Man! Landing due to an unknown force. No damage detected. Phew, I thought I was gonna die. Thanks, Sheena. I'm sure glad I was able to summon her. Excuse me, but Professor Sage and Genus are. That's right. We have to save them. Damn! They must have escaped! Give us back our friends! Silence! You're in for a world of hurt. I have nothing set for them. All right, let's change that. Fiery destruction. Okay, okay. It is nothing. Demon Fang. Demon Fang. It is not. Demon Fang. Demon Fang. Demon Fang. Demon Fang. Demon Fang. Demon Fang. It is nothing. Demon Fang. Okay, okay. Demon Fang. Demon Fang. Okay, okay. Demon. All right, we want to change for sales. Come, Origin! 
They have a lot of health. Rescue us. Of course. You're our friends. But we're half elves. So what's your point? Lloyd! What about the Tetheala half of our group? Do you mind if we join up with you? I'm from Mizuho. We're not exactly mainstream either. We're not that different. To tell you the truth, I can't say I'm really kosher with this. Then again, people have always treated me differently, saying that I'm a descendant of angels. So in a way, we're a lot alike. I just want to go home. I see. All right, then. By the way, why is Sheena here? I have orders from my chief. I'm supposed to observe your activities. That's typical of Mizuho. They're trying to decide if they should side with the king or you guys. So now we have two people keeping tabs on us. But I'm not trying to do anything or get in your way or anything, so... We know that already. You're an honest person, perhaps to a fault. At this point, I'm okay with anything. Now we just need Sheena to form a pact with Volt, and we can get those Riards working. Volt? Sheena? Uh, nothing. Then shouldn't we go get the Riards first? Either way, Volt's temple is on the other side of the Grand Tetheala Bridge. It'll be faster if we pick up the Riards, since the bridge is closed off right now. Pick up? How are you planning on moving those things? <laughs> Just leave that to me. I prepared a secret weapon just in case something like this happened. What secret weapon? It wouldn't be any fun if I spoiled the surprise. Now let's get going to the Fuji Mountains! I can't believe we're gonna have to climb that mountain again. Venus Rain, join your party. All right. So let us reorganize. Half elves and Tetheala. So Rain and the Kid are really half elves. What, are you gonna discriminate against them too? I'm sure it sounds like that, but you've got to understand, I've been educated this way since birth. half elves are stupid, savage, filthy creatures. You? Don't get mad, I'm just stating the common view. Well, I haven't been around them very long yet, but I can see they're good people and not any different from us. Good. Knowing that, but still being unable to shake the feeling is what discrimination is all about, though. That is very wise words. And on that, we're going to call it an episode. So I hope you enjoy. Please like, comment, subscribe, share the video, and tell me what you think in the comment section down below. See you guys in the next episode. Have a wonderful day, and God bless.